This paint is beautiful, man. Look at this paint. It's like uh, some type of uh, jade green or something like that. I mean, look at this frat saw, bro. Look at this. Look at this. Bigger than life, man. Look at that. This would be uh, like a Spencer Tracy hero car in one of them Spencer Tracy and Catherine Hepburn movies. From Here to Eternity or something like that. Oh, and it's a two-door convertible. I didn't even know that. Two-door convertible. This whole story, this car has a whole story behind it. That in the middle of production, they changed the length of the car. But they, they, they did it crudely by creating this back panel here. So this car is about three inches shorter than it should be because they didn't understand corporate espionage and rumor and rumor mills. Definitely. See, all the dimensions are right, except when you get to this quarter panel. This quarter panel. Chrome is beautiful, man. See, when you, don't, when you, when you got one of these, man, you really have to, because they don't make any of these parts. Well, I, don't see, I can't say they don't make any of them. These parts are not considered where the money maker is. The money makers are with the other Chrysler era cars from the 60s. For you to get parts for this, man, you'd have to, you know, I mean, there was a race car, the Polara 330, that you probably could find parts for. See, it's a rarity. Only one of 2089, built in 1960, uh, I'm assuming that's saying 1962. It's got the 361 Golden Lion in it, four bell carburetor, dual exhaust. You see? Glade Green, one respray. This is factory original color. This is who? You know, and it's got the push button 727 in it. You know, 1962. I don't know if you can see that push button. 